Chicago in her 60s was Friday confirmed as the second patient in U.S. soil infected with a deadly New Year's or new virus originating in China, according to health officials, with 50 other suspected cases under investigation. Let's listen in. The patient is a woman in her 60s. Most importantly, I'm pleased to report that she is clinically doing well and is in stable condition. She traveled to Wuhan, China in late December and returned to the U.S. on January 13th. A few days after arriving home, the patient began to feel unwell. The patient has been very helpful as we've been gathering information about her contacts in recent days. She was not symptomatic when flying. And based on what we know now about this virus, our concern for transmission before symptoms develop is low. So that is reassuring. She has limited close contacts, all of whom are currently well and who will be monitored closely for symptoms. We will also be monitoring the health care workers who have cared for and continue to care for this patient. That this is a single travel associated case, not a local emergency. We obviously take emerging viruses very seriously, and there are still many unanswered questions about this novel virus. But I can reassure you that even with this Chicago case, the health risk to the general public from novel coronavirus remains low at this time, both nationally and in Chicago.